the idea was to worship God in a very cosmopolitan way, um, picking songs that goes across generations and seasons, so many people can be touched. We decided to do covers of songs that we absolutely love, beautiful lyrics, songs that goes across generations and many seasons. A couple of weeks ago, we uh, did something quite different. We recorded a session, a live session. It's one of our few ones we've done over um, a couple of years. And it went quite different than what we normally do. We're here to just talk about how the whole thing went, how it came about, the atmosphere especially. So when people watch it, they can feel what we were trying to put out there. At least they know why, why did these people gather together on that particular day to put something like that together. How do you feel the day went? Um, the day, on the day we had a lot of people present because it wasn't just a group. So there was a lot of movement, um, a lot of camera people going up and down and it required a lot of organisation. So it was a bit hectic but once everyone knew what they were doing, um, the ball started rolling in. Yeah, it was. It went smoothly. It was fun. For me, it was just an outcry unto God, and to do it with everyone was just an amazing experience. To be honest, when I hear a song and I connect to it straight away, is is a really big thing for me. So, as soon as the song, the song had started, I hadn't even heard the lyrics yet or anything. It was just instrumentals that were going and that were playing, and then the lyrics started, and it just actually resonated within my spirit what they were actually saying, how God has made a way, even, even though it may seem as though there is no way. God always makes a way and I feel like that's something that can relate to everyone. Every song sort of tells its story and everybody can relate to it in a different way in life in general. Everyone's in, going through different seasons so when somebody does hear it you could be going yes. through a storm and you hear one of the songs and it speaks to you about that storm. So I think that's what was really amazing about the song choices. When you're worshipping God and you worship with music when the words really speak to you, you can pull everybody in because everybody understands kind of what you're trying to express and that's the amazing thing about music, you can express yourself so freely and I think especially with that song it made me express it very freely and I think that's why that atmosphere was created, definitely. Overall we have a great band, very understanding and they always try to understand the vision that the singer actually has for the song and they try to incorporate ideas as well so that you can come with a great final product. So overall, it's always great. Um, sometimes they do come with ideas that you're not too keen on, but eventually you do get there. Sometimes you have someone that has some you know, pretty wild ideas and then you as a singer is like, nope. But overall, because we have a friendship as well, we're able to overcome things and come to you know common ground. Down in my soul that I can't contain, that I can't control. I want more of you, God. I want more of you, God. Say the fire, Lord, in my soul, God. That I can't contain, that I can't control, Lord. As a community, we need to learn to rise above every storm that life brings. And we have to do it together in Christ. And that was our inspiration in naming the projects rising.